<laughs> Good evening. Good evening, Teach. Good evening, Jacqueline. How are you? Bye. 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 Good. <laughs> okay, let's see. I have four people. Oh my goodness, you're early. <laughs> I will see if I can, okay, I want to see this, five, we were five, right? Okay, yes. Oh, nice, okay, I can do it, but later, all right. Okay, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Jessica. Okay, let's see. Everybody has to be here. So I cannot assign you if you're not here. Okay, there we are. Okay, nice. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Salvador. Mm -hmm. No, nobody else. Sorry, that. Okay. Um, no. Mm, all right, let's check. Okay, let's wait for the rest, all right? And, okay, 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 okay. Excellent, they are joining, good. Okay. Where are you? I don't see your name, ah, your number four. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Good. Perfect. Good, 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 good. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Carla. So some of you already saved, right? Because you finished the exam yesterday. <laughs> you are saved. Yes, Belki, you're in group number one. In group number one was the two, four, seven people. More people were in, in, in group one. Okay, excellent. People are joining. Nice. Good, because we're going to do it. I think that because if not everybody joins early, we can start right now as a whole class. What do you think? Or do we go to the small groups again? What do you think? What do you prefer? <laughs> In little groups. In little groups, small groups, all right. Small. So before everybody joins, um, we are going to finish a little bit, a little practice that we were missing uh, yesterday. Okay, let's check. We're going to do a practice uh, so that everybody joins. All right. So it's this one. Yeah, that one. Excellent. Good. Now you are ready, right, for the oral exam because you practiced a lot yesterday or not. What do you think? Are you ready? Now you say. No. But you practiced a lot. Okay, I have only 18 people. So we are going to uh, have a listening practice right now. Yeah, so you chill out, all right, you relax. And then when everybody is in the class, we create the groups. Mm -hmm. I hope I can join the groups as, it, as they were yesterday. I hope. If not, we're going to do it differently. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, with different persons. Excellent. I have only half the class, so I cannot do it right now. All right. Um. So before the rest, yeah, we're going to discuss and then we're going to do that. Let's see over here. Look. Nice. All right. I have a question for you to start. Yes while the rest of the people join. Look at this question, Carla. Can you help me read, Carla Antonieta? Okay. 
do you usually help your co-worker with their tasks? Ah, do you usually help your co-workers with their tasks? Yeah. Tell me that it, tell me if in your job you help your co-workers do things or not. Yeah, in my case, I help every day my co-workers because uh, it's, it's usually they have a question for me. Uh -huh. And I they want well, no. I have the answer for for that question and and that's it. <laughs> and that's it. Only only doubts and questions, all right? Good. Yeah. Some, someone else? Do you help your co-workers? Hmm. Yes, in my case, uh -huh. I usually help because I knew the area. Mm -hmm. And then I need to um, mm -hmm. for example, uh, I don't know what you say, uh, códigos. The codes or the passwords? No. No. Uh, no. Some codigos de inventarios. Ah, uh, yeah, they are codes then. Codes. Sorry? They are codes. They are codes. Yeah, they are codes. So you help them with the codes. Okay. Uh huh. Something else you can uh, say? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, it's raining. Or not? No. No. Uh, I heard something. Yes. Alison, what do you think? Do you usually help your co-workers? Yes. Uh, in my case, I help with campaign designs because the time is very short mm -hmm. for the deliveries. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. But besides, besides your, your real work, I mean, do you help them with something? Mm-hmm apart from your job or in general uh, okay. in general <laughs> in general right i know in general all right someone else <laughs> okay jessica I I usually help my co-workers because I know, uh, uh, for example, in my job, we use Photoshop uh -huh. and, and, and when the partner don't, doesn't know, I can... I can make explain the the step by step. For example, for edit a, a photo or a or a test. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. What about you, Carla? What do you think? I usually ask my workers mm -hmm. for help with time of home uh, warranties. Okay. Okay, so in this case, you ask for help. Yes. <laughs> ah, do you, do you help your coworkers? Do you help them? Yes, teacher. An example? Um, um, the time of home warranties. Uh huh. It's the same, right? They help you. You help them. Yes. Ah, okay. Nice. Thank you. Whew. Catherine. In my case, uh, I work in I work in hospital. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I send to me other areas to support mm -hmm. to different areas of mm -hmm. my work. Uh -huh. ah, Example, okay. mm -hmm. I give information 
Uh, a page. Uh -huh. Oh, cleaning other areas. Or cleaning other areas, okay. Good. Uh, Salvador wants to participate, yes? Yes, teacher. I help them when they have questions about purchase orders. Uh -huh. And orders, quantities, colors, and things related mm -hmm. to customer orders of client. Okay, for customers' orders, so nice. Okay, yes. good. Uh, the rest already, ah, Carla Antonieta. Me cuesta, me cuesta, by the way. Ah, try, try, try. Okay. I must always help my co-worker fill out sales collection reports in the area. They visit daily. Okay. They, excuse me, can you repeat the rest? Good evening. They visit daily. Ah, oh, they visit daily. Okay. Visit or visit? Visit? Visit. Visit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hello, Miguel. Good evening. Okay, for the ones who are just joining, we are discussing something before we wait for everybody to join and continue with the oral exam. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so do you have an answer for this question, the rest of the people? Do you ask your coworkers for help? No. Ivan, what do you think? Good evening. Um, in my case, I work in treasury. Mm -hmm. um, I usually share uh, the payment uh, compro compro mm -hmm. controls with, uh, payment mm -hmm. uh, or comprobantes. Uh, they are receipts or recibos Receipt. also receipts Receipt. uh -huh. okay. with my my coworker. Uh, with your co-workers, okay. Yes. You help like that. Good. Becky? Uh, in my job, mm -hmm. I do help my co-workers to decide the quality of product and take decision about uh, accept or not accept. About accepting? Or not. Accepting. Okay. okay, accepted or not? Accepted. All right, something. Rolando? Uh, good evening, teacher. Good evening. In my case, uh, I help my friend at work to mm -hmm. organize or mobilize no, no. pies. Transport. Piece, piece, uh -huh. piece, piezas. The pieces. The pieces. Of parts. Uh, or parts when they are in, in the area operation. In the operation area. Okay. Nice, let's see. Mm, okay, good. Uh, Miguel and then Roxana. I usually uh, need, a, need a help. I work alone. Mm -hmm. okay. Is it right? Excuse me. Excuse me, Miguel. Sorry. Don't listen? No, I didn't listen. I had problems over oh, here. Okay. I was sick. Okay. Uh, uh -huh. I usually mm -hmm. don't help. Uh, I work lonely. Ah, I work alone. Alone. That's the alone. one. I oh, work okay. alone. Ah, okay. okay. So it's just yourself. It's only you. Yes. Ah, okay. That's different. Maybe you ask someone else for help. Okay. okay. Oh, people. Remember, this is just practice, all right? Roxana and then Jorge Cuadra. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, I usually in my area. Uh huh. Area. I am in charge of inventory orders to supply some areas. Mm -hmm. For example, cleaning service, general service, 
Mm -hmm. uh, and the other thing. And other things. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Jorge. Um, I usually help my co-workers um, when they need help in product quality decisions. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. Quality decisions. And Raquel, you will be the last one. Uh-huh. Good evening, teacher. Uh, in my case, help my coworkers then when they have the doubts about new products. Okay, when they have doubts about the products. Okay, so let's let's um, leave this question open for later. I think we are already twenty seven people in class. So I think, do you think we're ready to continue with your Alisa? What do you think? Are you ready? Yes, we must be. <laughs> we must be. Teacher. Yes, Rolando. I am no group. No? Group. Groups. Yes. Okay. Uh, yes, we're going to do it in the groups again because everybody prefers that. Groups. For yeah. the exam? For the exam, yes. Okay. Rolando was. I will, yeah. try, I will try to create the same groups from yesterday. Rolando, 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 you didn't have, right? I will assign you with, yeah, with group number four. Thank you. Okay. So I will create the groups right now. Okay. I hope ah, more people are here. All right. Good. So in room number one, I have Belki. Gabriela is not here. Okay. I have Gilberto, Jennifer, Kenya, Manuel. It's like easy. Yeah. It's Miguel. Ah, huh? ah, yeah, Manuel and Miguel, both. Okay. <laughs> okay. Then I have group number two. I have Carlos, Diana, Ivan. Everybody is here. Perfect. Jorge, eh, and Carla, and Carla. Okay. Good. If someone is missing, then I'm gonna do it. In group number three. I had Cindy, perfect, you're here. Jacqueline, Catherine, and Roxana, only, only girls. And Roxana and Sandra. Sandra is not here yet, so I will assign it later. Okay, in group number four, I have Allison, Francia, Luis is still is in here. Raquel is in here, yeah, Raquel. Salvador, Sergio, and Rolando. Okay, there we are. And in group number five, hola, hello. Eh, yo igual no sé en qué grupo me va a poner. Ahorita uh, Jorge Garcia is not here. Omar is not here. Jessica is not, Jessica. Okay, so Sonia, I think you're gonna go in group number five. Uh -huh. Yeah, because uh, Jennifer is in group number one. What are you doing here? And Francisco is... Mm -mm. Francisco was not assigned. Okay, I will put everybody in group number five. Only Jennifer that goes in group number one because she already did the exam. Sure, I'm in the last group. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Group number five, I cannot assign it right now, but I'm going to open and then I'm going to assign the missing ones. So I visit you. Okay, so I hope that you receive the invitation and accept it. Okay, go ahead. Uh, yeah. Okay, there we are. Unassigned. Uh, okay, but you're in a group. Mm -hmm. Only Jennifer Marisol, it says, but you were in group number one. Okay, accept the invitation, please. Excellent. Excellent, everybody. It was easy. Perfect. Okay, Oof. only Miguel is missing. Okay, good. Let me see who's here. Jessica, uh, group number five. Ah, but I already assigned you in a different one. Jessica. Yeah, I, there we are. Okay, so I will join group number two and we start with the questions. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Now, okay, we, we started with one question yesterday. You remember? 
Yes, number Excellent. 10. Ah, right. Number 10. So I'm going to share my screen and we're going, we are going to start. My internet is here and here we are. Okay. We have, ah, I will put the time. So we have 15 minutes only. Okay, there we are. Oh, look at that one. Ah, that one is easy. All right. So you can start answering or the teacher goes in order. Ivan is first. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, the three personal values uh, mm -hmm. I, I put in the practice, uh -huh. my job is number one, responsibility. Mm -hmm. Number uh -huh. two, honesty. Yes. And number three, uh, punctuality. Punctuality, all right. Try to give examples when you apply them, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. But that's perfect. Okay. Okay, Ivan, nice. What about you, Diana? Um, in my work, I practice responsibility mm -hmm. from the report to my boss. Uh, need it. Yes. And respect for all my co-workers. They uh, work in Guatemala, but mm -hmm. me, I in El Salvador. So we uh, talk from, uh, how do you say, or oh, como puedo decir, hablo por Zoom? We, uh, we have, we have, uh, Online meeting. meetings, online meetings. Mm -hmm. And I practice efficiency. <laughs> efficiency, efficiently. I try to oh, practice efficiency. Efficiency, okay, nice. Online meetings, That's good, thank you. Carlos. Okay, in my case, I practice punctuality. Mm -hmm. I stay at time every day. <laughs> I practice responsibility when I I do what I, I need I do and respect because I learned these values through my family. Okay. Values, values, pronunciation, values. Okay, mm -hmm. and it's, it's stay on time, not at time. Stay at on time. time. Mm -hmm. I stay on time or I get to my work on time. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Uh, after Carlos, who do I have? Uh, Carla, oh, we are many over here. Oh, okay. Uh, punctuality mm -hmm. will longest to assist and responsibly. We have a, a online meeting. Also, okay, Carla. Okay, nice responsibility. Good. Uh, after Carla, we have Carla also, <laughs> Carla Antonieta. Okay. In my work, I practice several values of responsibility, respect, mm -hmm. punctuality, uh -huh. with every people. With all the people. Uh -huh. With all the people. Okay, nice. Who's missing? Who's missing, people? Jorge, Jorge is missing. Um, I practice in my work responsibility, honesty, confidentiality, and respect. Okay, excellent. Good. Yes. All right. Try to give details. If you give details, it's better. All right. Let's move with this question. Nobody's missing, right? Huh. Two, four, six. Okay. I need to assign one person is Jorge Garcia. He was in group number five. Oh, no. Okay, there we are. <laughs> okay, good. Next question. We have five minutes in one question. Look, that was nice. And you are speaking, not the teacher. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> oh, my. You didn't like this one yesterday? What is the difference between a mission and a vision? Do you remember? Maybe one or two persons only. 
Okay. The mission is the, the purpose of the company to achieve. And yes. the vision refers to where the company is going and mm -hmm. what is a uh, meeting along terms goals are. Okay, thank you very much, Carlos. Okay, good. Let's go for another one. Mm -hmm. Okay, because this is the same answer for everybody. All right. Yeah. Yeah. The mission is the reason. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Tell me, tell me, Jorge. Uh, the mission is the reason for being, uh, but instead the vision refers to where this yeah. company is uh, head and what mm -hmm. is worth are in the medium and long term. Long term, all right. Okay, good. Excellent. You had the information close over there at hand. Perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Look at this one. Think. Uh, rem I hope you remember because it's in the Schoology. It's the forum, I think, the first forum. Think about your company. Okay. Who do you work for? If there is your type of industrial classification, in my case, it's education. And uh, where or the headquarters, the location. Who remembers? Question we did it yesterday, teacher. Ah, that's, ah, yeah, company expertise. I'm sorry, you gave it. It's this yeah. first one. Sorry, remove. Uh huh. So the other one. Yeah, that was number one. What is your company known for? Food. Remember, ing after four. Uh huh. Who's going to start? A brave person to start. <laughs> Nobody wants to participate. Wait a minute. Who's the victim? I, I, ah, the victim. Good. I chose the order <laughs> I have in here. So Ivan is, uh, no, Carlos is the first one from for, for my list, in my list. Oh, no. <laughs> so you're an okay. expert. Speak. Okay. Yeah. My company is famous mm -hmm. uh, because the company is specialized in money transfers and bill payment service. Okay, don't forget about building ING. Okay, thank you. What about Diana? Uh, my company is known for always offering low price. Offering I low work price. for Walmart, and the slogan is like always uh, bring, okay. bringing mm -hmm. the low prices to the Salvadorian families. And also, the, uh, we think uh, mm -hmm. the client or the clienta, I don't know. Yeah, the client. Say. The client is the, the client first. is first. The client is first. Okay, the client has the reason or always has the reason. I don't know how you say it in Spanish. <laughs> yeah, that's the word. Okay, uh, Jorge. Jorge. Um, people in love as distributors in El Salvador of food and pharmaceutical products with full coverage nation, nationwide. Mm -hmm. And the, the name of my company is Inverton. Yeah, nationwide. Okay. Thank you. Remember that I check later. I have to watch the class again and you check your, your speaking. Okay, good. Thank you, Ivan. Okay, uh, I work in El Salvador. My company is now uh, because I uh, offer staffing and payrolling service. Mm -hmm. Okay, your company is known for offering. Good. Offer. Remember the grammar. Good. Who's missing? One more person that we change question. Don't worry. Carla. Carla and Carla. Una. Okay, Carla Antonieta and then Carla Lisset. Okay. <laughs> My company is famous for Indian greetings and the best price for the sales. Okay, okay, okay. Carla, Carla, Carla Lise. My company is now for its account, mm -hmm. a contact center. 
Okay. Center, really? Okay. Uh, nice. A contact center. Ah, contact center. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Yes. And the last one, people. Papi, we, have, Va para fuera. we have 10, 10 minutes. So we are, this is the last question. Uh, this is personal. Oh. And give me details using the simple past. Oh. Be careful. Be careful with went, ate, visited. Okay, be careful. All right, so if I, I don't know why I get confused. Yes, Ivan, you're the first one. I get confused. Okay. <laughs> okay, in my last vacation, mm -hmm. uh, I did go to uh, Villa Bella in mm -hmm. Ilopango. What did you do? Who did you go with? Details. Uh, okay, uh, I, uh, I swim. In, uh, and uh, eating uh, the typical food is the pesca. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. The past form. Let's check that. Okay, Diana? So, mm -hmm. in my last vacation, I went to the beach mm -hmm. with my family. Mm -hmm. We was to celebrating the birthday of my younger brother and mm -hmm. my niece. Mm -hmm. They are uh, from Julia, July. July. I don't know how to say July. <laughs> so we visited La Sojas mm -hmm. Resort and we uh, celebrate for two, two days, one night. Wow, long trip. <laughs> Excellent. All right, <laughs> one more person. I'm trying to make everybody participate, okay? Ooh. Yes, go ahead. Okay. My 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 life is very simple and very boring. On my last vacation, uh, I didn't really go out anywhere. I spent most of the days at at home. Traveling resting. from the kitchen. <laughs> The yeah <laughs> yeah this, this is my 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 traveling route <laughs> that's right that's right yeah. um uh, it wasn't a problem for me because i really love stay at home i i love my bed i love my tv and i love my my video games <laughs> I, I i love my my house imagine if we spend all every day working obviously we need to rest and we enjoy yeah. the, the house yeah I don't think uh, the the is special go to the beach. I I hate the beach. I I don't like it. <laughs> the sand, the the sun. I no, I don't like. Okay, we have different <laughs> likes. Okay, video games. That's good for you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It's not the video games. It's the the. I I I I feel more. Uh, comfortable. I, I feel more. Yeah, comfortable. Mm -hmm. I think that was the word. Okay, thank you. Perfect. Jorge. Yeah, I visited Portillo in Honduras. Mm -hmm. It is a mountain where you can enjoy the landscape. Mm -hmm. Landscapes. And, uh, Landscapes, like mountains. Mountains, mountains yes. Mm -hmm. okay. In this place, place are restaurants and when well, restaurants. restaurants. <laughs> to enjoy the food. That's important to eat differently. Okay, nice. Okay, no, I don't think only four people answer, but you participated in the other ones. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Yeah, you participated like three or four times. Okay, that's good. So how did you feel? Easy, difficult? So so. So so. So so. Bad. For the for the next exam, I think I will include more more questions for the simple past. Okay, so sure. that we practice. Although you do it in in principium in the next module, you study the simple past. No worry. Okay, so you have time while I go for group number three, four, and five to complete the exam to complete the homework assignment. So please take advantage of time. I think that we are going to finish around nine and we start with the next topic. Unit three. Okay. Okay, yes. so see you. Thank see you, you later. See you later.
Okay, you. next okay. group. I will join the next group. Group number three. Uh, room three, here we are. <coughs> no. Oh, I was scared. <laughs> hello, hello. Only girls hello. here. Only girls. Two, yeah. We are only five. Excellent. Yeah. So are, are you ready to answer the question? So, so. So, 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 let's try, okay? Let's try. I will give you 15 minutes and we try to practice, check and answer. All right. Let's go for the questions here. Um, yeah, we leave it like this. So I will share my screen. Is this one? Okay, we have seven questions and we will have only 15 minutes. Okay, if all of you can answer the questions, perfect. I hope you practice. Ah, and I didn't want to move. Okay, look at this one, it's very easy. Maybe only two or three persons can participate. Do you remember a company with the branches and location? Yes, Roxana. Uh, the name is a company we have mm -hmm. two headquarters uh -huh. in in night branches in the in the national yes in the nation nation ouch or in the country uh, it, mm -hmm. yes in the location in the beverage is in San Salvador, uh -huh. uh, Avenue Independence, number, number, uh, uh -huh. you don't remember, 526, 526, uh -huh. 526 uh -huh. in San Salvador. Okay, Independence Avenue, uh -huh. really? Independence Avenue. Uh -huh. In the same as uh, in San Salvador. Recognize the relatives in the front. Okay. Okay, okay. Somehow we need to practice. Don't worry. Next person. Uh, me. Okay, go ahead, Cindy. Uh, the company is a speed motor shop. Uh -huh. It has eight branches and its headquarters is in San Salvador. Excellent, good. That's your company or an example company? Uh, is where I work. Ah, okay, Cindy, excellent, okay. Catherine, what do you think? At, uh, you can say any, company. any company. Uh, other company. Yeah, you can be any. And uh -huh. M E. Yes. We do. 14 branches in uh -huh. the 14 depart department. Yeah, department. Department, department. Department is national. Yeah. It's national. Uh, yeah, don't worry. Give your ideas. ¿Cómo se dice ese encargado? It's in charge of. It's in charge of the production. Produ production. 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 That's true. Ah, okay. Yeah, that's true. Okay. There we are. Thank you. And the headquarters? Where are the headquarters? Headquarters and 14 departments. Departments. Yes, you said it. I'm sorry. <laughs> My memory. Okay, thank you, Catherine. What about Jacqueline? What about you? Name any. Any, 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 any company with the branches in the headquarter. In my case, in my work, only company branch. Uh -huh. It's branch because only one. Um, building, building. Yes. 
And where is it? The location. The location is in El, is in El Salvador, um, mm -hmm. Ilopango. Ilopango, okay. Yes. Perfect. Who's missing? Who's missing? Who's missing? Sandra is missing. Um, okay, teacher. Um, my, co my company and Solaire. Uh huh. Um, three branches. It has three branches. It has three branches. Um, uh, um three loc locations. Three, uh -huh. three rooms. Three, three buildings. Three rooms. Ah, uh, cuartos only. No, uh, zonas. Ah, okay, you can say zones. That can be, you can say three zones. Ajá, uh -huh. uh -huh. zones, zonas, zones, ajá. Uh -huh. Como salas también, ¿verdad? So we talk, uh, maybe not branches, but sucursales, right? We were talking about uh -huh. that. Ajá. Uh -huh. Three, mm. three stores. We can say three stores. Mm -hmm. Um, local Echon, San Salvador, Soyapango, um, y El Salvador del Mundo. And, okay, only in San Salvador. All right. San... Okay, you say location, okay? Location. Oh, location. location, suavecito, location. Location. Yes. Lo... That, we need to practice that. I, I will assign you some audios maybe for you to practice. Okay, I think we finished. Let's go for another question. We have five minutes only, you see, in one question. And everybody thinking. What do you do at your work? Okay, let's go straight. What do you do at your job? Okay, Roxana, you're the first one. Uh, in my door. Uh-huh. Uh, I am charged the mm -hmm. the right the right reports mm -hmm. report the budget and the budget uh, is small. Uh -huh. The the other costs. Okay, nice, good. What about uh, Cindy? Okay. <clears throat> uh, in my job, I check emails. Uh, do inventory count, file taxes, and do the company's accounting. Excellent. All right, Catherine. In my job, clean my area and attain, attain, page, mm -hmm. give information. And give information. Good. Pronunciation. We have to check that one. Okay. Clean my area. Okay, good. Clean the area, good. All right, I'm sorry, Jacqueline and Sandra are missing. Okay, Jacqueline? Bye. What do you do at your job? I complete the, the information, mm -hmm. technical service. Yes. Only. Only that, okay. Sandra, what do you do at your job? In my job, I cover ausentes, prepare Re reports. Uh, prepare reports? Uh -huh. uh, check, check production materials. Mm -hmm. Yeah, only that. Sí? Yeah. Okay, can you repeat? Check. Check. Production. Production. Material. Material. Excellent. It sounds better, but check production material. I check, check. production material. Yes, you need to practice, okay? Try to try to speak as much as possible. So you practice. Thank you, Sandra. And the last question for us girls. The last question, because we have already 10 minutes. Good. Question number three. Okay, that one is very easy. Why are you learning English? Uh-huh, okay, Roxana. 
I am learning English because in addition to learning it, when I uh -huh. travel to other countries, I can understand the language very well. Uh -huh. Also because uh, it gives me new opportunities. It gives me new vocabulary, excellent. Yeah. Don't forget that I am learning English to travel. I am learning English to speak with, okay? The infinitive of purpose, grammar. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Jacqueline? Hi, teacher. Yeah, why, why are you learning English? Um, in my case, I want to speak very fast, number one. Number two, I need to um, better work. Uh -huh. nice. um, I like to translate the other people okay. or maybe travel the other country. Ah, to other countries. Nice. Cindy. I am learning English because I want to be a bilingual accountant uh -huh. to use it in my work and not depend on the translator. And also, don't... Uh -huh. <laughs> and don't depend on the translator. Uh -huh. Also, I want to sing and pronounce the songs well in English. Excellent. Good. Catherine? I learn English because for a better job. Mm -hmm. uh, for singing my favorite song mm -hmm. and communication with other people, the other country. Uh, I like it, the language. Okay, communicate, not communication. Communicate with other people. Communicate. Okay. Yeah, like that. Good. Who's missing, Cindy? Yo lo había dicho. <laughs> ah, sorry, sorry, Sandra. I said Sandra. Sorry, Cindy. <laughs> it's Sandra. I'm, I'm learning English over net. Um, in travel country to travel uh -huh. country to travel other to another country to travel to another country okay i think we need to copy more in class okay so you have the examples and you check thank you sandra okay people i think we're gonna start with this question it's exactly 15 minutes hi right. how did you feel good so so Happy, sad. How did you feel? Nervous. I'm very happy. <laughs> very nervous. happy and nervous. Okay. I hope I have the results for Monday. Okay. So I share them with you. Now, I go for group number four and group number five. So you have time. Please complete the exam and complete the homeworks. Don't go because at nine or 9.15, we are going to continue with unit number three. So don't go. Aprovechen el tiempo and complete activities in Schoology. Please. Okay. Thank okay. You. See you in some Thank minutes. You. I will go for group number four. Thank you. Bye. Uh, the mission is the company's reason for being behind. And the vision is where the company is hidden. Uh, next question, number one. Why are you learning English, Francia? I, I want to learn English. Uh, I'm looking to go in the digital marketing, achieve professional, professional growth. I would love to meet more people. Uh, question number five, Sergio. What are you responsible for a for our for a new job? Hello, teacher. Un alto. No sé si continuamos nosotros o. Just yes, answer, yeah. sorry, just answer that question and then we start. I was taking some error. Uh-huh. Okay. Just answer Raquel's question. Yes. Uh -huh. 
uh, I am responsible for assigned projects mm -hmm. that are completed within the estimate time. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. I, I hope I could record each break room, but it's impossible. All right. So I'm going to start sharing my roulette, my spinning wheel. So we decide on the questions we are going to answer. Okay, it's group number four. I have how uh, many people? Yes. Okay, Teacher. good. Yes? Question in Spanish. Yes. <laughs> Eh, usted va a girar la ruleta y nos va a preguntar a uno por uno o yeah. en grupo le tenemos que responder. Ah, uh, uh, wait. Ah, uh, yeah. No, uh, yeah, the question we get, all the people answers. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we have 15 minutes. Oh my goodness. 15 minutes. So I don't know, three or four questions for everybody. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So ready, we start now. And let's see, I hope easy questions, not difficult ones. Please, please, please. Oh, green or yellow? Uh-huh. Finger mistake. I'm famous, I'm famous for finger mistakes. What is El Salvador famous for? Okay. El Salvador is famous for Tevish. Mm -hmm. Okay, wait, I'm going to start with something. Uh, famous for, that's question number one for group number four. All right, remember, El Salvador is famous for having the best beaches, for being safe, etc. Remember that preposition plus ing, okay? Try to use it. Rolando is the first one. Go ahead. Okay. Um... The El Salvador is famous for its beaches, volcanoes, its um, president for Bay, uh -huh. uh, a small but a uh, hardworking country. And a working country. And a working. All right. Thank you, Salvador. El Salvador. Is famous for your volcanoes, lakes, and beaches. Uh -huh. For its volcanoes. For? For its volcanoes. For its volcanoes. Because okay. El Salvador is not a person, so its volcanoes. Good. Okay. Sergio? Okay. El Salvador is famous for the lakes and the majestic volcanoes and beautiful beaches. Okay. Nice, Raquel. Uh, El Salvador is famous for being a safe country. For being, okay, being. Being. Being, being. a safe country. A safe country. Repetition. El Salvador is, fam is famous for being a safe country. Perfect, Francia. El Salvador is famous for this one. Okay. Uh, okay, good. Hey, Alison. El Salvador is famous for having 365 days of security or zero <laughs> deaths. Okay. <laughs> yes, I saw it on Twitter <laughs> as well. I see news. I see news. <laughs> uh -huh. You watch the news. I don't like news because I cry. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Who's missing? Is Rolando here? Oh yeah, he you did it. You did it. two four six. Two four six. Ah, oh, we are complete now. What about who's missing? Someone is missing. Ah, Luis. Luis is not here, right? No. No, all right. Good. So he was missing. Okay. Luis is missing. Yeah. So people who don't do the oral, they will have to record an audio. An audio. Okay, mm -hmm. next question. Uh, please, please, please. Don't go technical, don't go technical. <laughs> okay, what is your company known for? Another one for ING use. Uh -huh. Okay, Sergio. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, my company is 
further for OUR ERP uh -huh. and business intelligence. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, Rolando? Okay, my, my company is Empresa Repuestos. It is a company that sell parts for vehicles. For bikes? That's for no, for vehicle. Ah, vehicles or cars. Vehicles for, cars, or cars. Oh, okay, <laughs> part for cars. That is Trogo, El Salvador, Honduras, and Nicaragua. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, Salvador and then Francia. Okay, my company is known for making clothes of well known brands. My company is Supertex. Thank you. Perfect. I -N -G use Francia. My company is known for selling out parts in Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. And Raquel. Uh, my company is Atento. It's now for being company customer server for other companies. Example, Digicel, Movistar. Excellent, excellent. Hello, Luis, you're here. Yes. Yeah. Hello, so we are uh, half the way, okay, asking questions. I think this is the second question. Yes. Are you are you comfortable, Luis? Are you ready? Yes, right? Uh, uh, yes. Yes, so uh, this is the question we are discussing right now. What is your company known for? Uh, what is your comfort number? My, my, Company is uh, it, the, the question is for me. Yeah, talk about oh, your okay. company. What is it known uh, for? My company known for is uh, bigger. Uh -huh. Is uh, is uh, expertise uh, uh, maintenance line maintenance maintenance uh, maintenance. Maintenance, uh, heavy maintenance, and then uh, structural repair. Okay. Is um, um, I don't know. Is uh, the the more the more people. Uh, mm -hmm. Joe in company. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, nice. Okay, let's okay, change. Good. Yeah, let's change question. Okay, next question. Question number three group. We have seven minutes only. Okay, group number three for group number four. another one we have repeated them in class so i don't think it's kind of difficult what are you responsible for at your work rolando okay um my responsible in my work is a change of the security of the office and the family of the owner uh -huh. Also supervise they properly. Uh huh. Okay. Nice. Uh, Salvador and Addison. Okay, I am responsible for making reports and sending them to my boss. Allison. I'm responsible for design brands and anime videos. Okay, designing. Designing. Remember, remember we have preposition ing. Okay, I'm responsible for designing. Good. Design. Thank you. That was Alison. Good. Raquel. And then Francia. Uh, I'm respon 
I'm responsible in my job is to complete the senior work on time. <laughs> okay, okay. It's, it's different, Raquel. When you say, I am responsible for or my responsibility is, it's different. So you say, I am responsible for, Raquel? Uh, I am responsible for, in my job, is to completing the assigned work on time. Okay, for completing, good. Uh huh. There we are. That's nice. That's correct. Francia. I am responsible for social media and email reports, including my boss and supervised co-workers. And supervising co-workers. Don't forget the ing oh, people. <laughs> Okay, we need more repetition in class. Good. Uh, uh, who's missing, Luis? What are you responsible for at your job? Uh, my responsible for uh, a yeah. job. No. For a job. Oh, okay. I am responsible for. I am responsible for. For. Uh, it's a. Uh, 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 control controlling uh, controlling the mechanic for uh, make the the perform uh, correctly the the task of the technician okay okay technicians Okay. Like checking the technicians work, no? Yes, monitoring and certify the, the job. Excellent. That's better. That's better. Okay. Words that you know. Good, Luis. Okay. Uh -huh. I think that we need to like to repeat more in class. Okay. Or you need to copy more examples from the class. I'm talking in general, not for Luis. It's for everybody. Okay. Sergio is missing. You're the last one. Okay. I am responsible for asking project. Assigning. Assigning com project. Mm -hmm. And that's completed, completed within the assigned time. Within the assigned time. Okay. Established time also. Good. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Okay. Good. I'm, I'm taking notes so that later I complete the, the, the criteria sheet. Okay, the last question for you, for this group, I hope it's easy. Okay, the last question. The first one, the easiest. Why are you learning English? Uh-huh. So, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm not shaking your hands. Okay, Rolando, Alison, and Salvador. Okay. Uh, I learn in English uh, uh -huh. for personal improvement, get a better salary and to travel and be able to communicate. Uh -huh. Communicate, the pronunciation, but it's Communi good. Communicate. Communicate. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, next. Alison. I learn in English to, for two reasons. Number one, enter in the international market as a graphic designer. And two, uh, for improve my speaking. For improving. Improving, improving. Uh -huh. Okay, don't worry, Salvador. Well, I learn in English to get best position mm -hmm. at my job and personal growth and for for personal growth and for personal growth excellent francia i learning english uh, looking to grow in the digital marketing i will love the i i will love to meet more people okay good and a professional group Professional, ah, professional growth. Okay, good. Raquel? 
um, learning English to have a better job, uh, travel to another country, and personal growth. And for personal growth, the same, almost the same answer. Sergio? Okay. Uh, be, because it's very important currency and other order of other jobs. Uh -huh. and, and travel to other countries. And travel to other countries, okay. And I think Luis is missing. No. Uh, the, the same question. Yeah, the same question. Why are you why are oh. you learning English? Okay, uh, because in my joy is very necessary uh, speak or learning English. Uh, uh, I have a uh, speak uh, with uh, 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 nat native Na American people. Native American, Na native. Native American people. Uh -huh. For airlines representative. For airlines representatives. Yes, uh -huh. yes. For in the technical performing a job in okay. the progress, I uh -huh. have a problem. Uh -huh. Yes, it's uh, very necessary for me for, for talking about the American people. Uh -huh. Okay, very necessary. Yes. Okay, good. I'm writing probably later, but I'm resting. Good. Nice. Two, four, six, seven people. Okay, that was the last question. So we have four questions in exactly 15 minutes. Okay, people. Were you nervous? Right. No. Okay. Next question. Next question. Next question. No, we finished. Ah, now you want another question. Now you. <laughs> now that we yeah. finish with another question, no people, now. Okay, so you have 15 minutes. Take advantage of time. You can complete missing activities in Schoology or start the exam, I don't know. Okay, because you are, I'm going just for one group, group. So you have 15 minutes and then we go back to the main session. Take okay. advantage of time. Take advantage of time and don't go, please. Okay. 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 Um, where do I join? Ah, uh, here, here, here. Okay, I will go for the last group, group number five. And then we start unit number three. There we are. The product is the Hello. I'm here. No. No. no, he says, no, it's not a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> No, uh, no, no, it's a supervisor no. checking that you speak English. <laughs> Uy, no, 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 yes. Mejor la teacher, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, people, so you are the last group, group number five. Are you ready? Ya va, ya va por nosotros, teacher. You are the last one, yes. Yeah, rápido. So quickly, <laughs> one hour. Because you were practicing, you didn't feel the time. Rápido. Yes. <laughs> Bye. Uh, okay. Bye. Okay. Question number one for you. I will share my screen. Remember, and I have my spinning wheel. All right. I will open the <clears throat> again. Okay. So I have all the questions. Okay. Everybody can answer each question. Uh, because we are only five people. No problem. Oh, Francisco, you're here. Yes. Okay, good. Ah, look at the first one. What is your company known for? Don't forget the <laughs> ING. Don't forget the ING. My company uh, is known for teaching English. Okay, what about you? Practicamente mi respuesta. Uh, oh, my, my, compa my company is known for teaching uh, and preparing the future of our country. I mean, our, our future professionals. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I, I hope you're not reading because <laughs> I see sometimes people are. Okay, perfect, Francisco. Uh, Jorge, what about you? 
What is um, your company known for? Um, my my company is known for um, mm -hmm. broadcast sermon. Broadcasting. A broadcasting sermon. Okay. Um. Um. También, uh, my company is, is known for. No sé si si así se dice. Bellowing, the church. For what? Bellowing. Uh, how Yo do you say? La palabra. How do you say it in Spanish? Um. Como que pertenece. Oh, for valuing. Okay, yes, I will check. Por, it. por pertenecer. Uh huh. Yes. Ah, sure. yeah, yeah. For belonging. Ah, uh, yes. Belonging. <laughs> That's the one. Belonging. Uh huh. Belonging. Repeat to repeat, church. Repeat to you. Ah, okay. My company is known for belonging. Uh huh. To church. Ah, there you are. That's perfect. Good. Uh, Sonia. My company is now for selling cell phone and home internet service. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, who's next? Elena. Um, my company is now for its sell or choose a bank. Okay, choosing. Okay, perfect. Selling and choosing, uh-huh. ING, remember, thank you. Next person, who's missing? I have Elin. Okay, Elin. My company is now for distributing consumer products. Distributing. Distributing. Yeah, pronunciation. Nice. Distributing. Mm -hmm. Omar, is Omar here? Distributing. No, Jessica is missing. No, I am here, teacher. No, I mean, you have to answer the question. Okay. Uh -huh. It's my turn. Yes, it's your turn. Sorry for the noise, but I I own the traffic. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay. Uh, I am work in El Diario de Hoy, and my company knows uh, for the make, makes, makes news. Uh -huh. And in my case, I am I am photojournalist, and I make uh, photos okay. uh, every day. Mm -hmm. My company is known for that. Okay. My Thank my company my company knows for make uh, news. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. The use of the ing. Remember. In general, but for everybody. Okay. Hello, Marvin. Can you participate? Or just listen it? Uh, at the moment, just listen, teacher. Okay, perfect. Okay, don't worry. Okay. So, next question, people. Next. <laughs> uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, why are you learning English? Oh, easy, don't make me mistakes. Teacher. Oh, okay, go ahead. Order? Me, teacher. Okay, no, she said me. She's she's first. Okay, okay. Okay, go ahead. I I learning English, person ground, and oh. is speaking another language. Okay, mm -hmm. the second one is okay. But why are you learning English? Next person? Um... Mm -hmm. I am I am learning English to travel to USA to, uh -huh. to the USA uh, mm -hmm. also because I need uh, to talk with my wife okay. in English. Yes, mm -hmm. excellent. You can say two or you can say four. Okay, yeah, two okay. options. Nice. Okay, perfect. Next person, Elena. Um, I am learning English so I can communicate other uh, people in another country. Nice, with 
people in another country. Nice. Jessica. Why are you learning English? No, Jessica. Sonia and then Jessica. I am learning English for a better pronunciation. 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 Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> For better, For better job opportunities. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Nice. Francisco. Okay, teacher. Uh, I'm learning English to improve myself professionally and socially. Mm -hmm. I think it's very important to grow and get new opportunities and better opportunities through, language, through learning a new language. Yes, perfect. Good. Nobody's missing two for six people, two for six. Or the Jessica, I don't know if you're back. Yes, yes, yes. So tell so, me, why are you oh, learning English? I am learning English because I need to uh, speak with another person, like a uh, United States or United Kingdom, for example, because uh, my job uh, leads uh, mm -hmm. because I uh, I am uh, pho I photojournalist and mm -hmm. we make a new person when an, an for another countries. Oh, okay, okay. You uh, work for different countries. Yes. Mm -hmm. That is the word. Only that. Only that. Okay. Thank uh, you. And mm -hmm. and and. and uh, support me, mm -hmm. make because I I need uh make another uh, text for for example. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh, yes. Okay. And okay. and and read. And reading or reading. Read is you, 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 uh, you need leer. you need to read. Read a books about the photo for for photographs, photographs because is the uh, is my passion. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> All right. For reading books in English, nice. Okay. Good. So I think that was the last one we have. I know we have two questions only. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Question number three. Did I remove or not? Easy. Easy. <laughs> oh, what is El Salvador known for? ING. El Salvador is known for having the best pupusas. I don't know. That's an example. What is El Salvador known for? So who's going to be first? Jorge. Jorge is first. Um, okay, teacher. Um. El Salvador is, is famous for its vol volcanoes, mm -hmm. um, for their pupusas. Yeah, for its um, pupusas. Ah, uh, its pupusas. Its pupusas, uh, for its pupusas, because El Salvador is not a person, so you can say there. Its pupusas. Ah, ah, its pupusas, mm -hmm. yes. Um, and for Mágico González. <laughs> okay, for el mágico, good. El mágico, yes. Okay, Sonia. Eh, the Salvador is famous at pupusas, beaches, and volcanoes. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. Lago de Cuatepeque. And for Lago de Cuatepeque, for having the Lago de Cuatepeque, good. Um, next person... Francisco and then Elena. Okay, teacher. Uh, El Salvador is famous for the typical food like pupusas, mm -hmm. nuegados, atole, and also for our beaches and mountains. Okay, nice. Elena? El Salvador is famous for typical food and landscapes and beach. beaches and beaches and beaches uh -huh. but careful with the pronunciation of beaches okay but Helene? 
El, el Salvador is famous for having, having pupusas. It's national anthem. Anthem, ah, okay, the, the, the uh -huh. himno, uh -huh. the volcanes and, and beaches. And beaches. beaches. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Another person, two, four, six, two, four, five. Who is missing? Yeah, Jessica. Me, teacher. <clears throat> yeah. El Salvador is famous is famous for use uh, legally Bitcoin for in the world. Okay. And, and the landscape too. Uh -huh. and, um creo que ay perdón se equivoqué. No, no okay. And for the food too mm -hmm. and in for the no in the surfer or beach. Uh, yeah, and yeah in the beach the surfing the, the surfers the surfers beach surfers beach surfers beach uh -huh. okay. that's it all right Let's go for the last question because people are waiting in the other groups. I hope they are working in the exam and completing that. Oh, do you remember about your company's expertise? For example, I work for Insa Four. Uh, it's in the education industry. The branches are in. I don't. Know, it has many branches, <clears throat> and the headquarters are in San Salvador. Okay. What about you? Okay. Okay. Go, Sonia. <laughs> sí. I have worked at the Central America for two years. I have learned a lot. Um, I have so many activities in the field of sales. I know many people, it's industrial telecommunication, or telecommunication. It has 10 branches in El Salvador, and it's headquarter is in Guatemala. Perfect, next. Mm. Okay, Jorge. You? Uh, I, okay. Um, el, el INTV mm -hmm. is a television channel um, belong to the entertainment industry. Mm -hmm. um, we are a religious channel. Mm -hmm. um, the headquarters is in mm -hmm. Soyapango. Mm -hmm. yes. And we have one branches uh, in Santa Ana. We broadcast a program with a family and educationally focus. Okay, excellent. Perfect. Next person. My my company is Group Steiner. Mm -hmm. Is a distributor of consumer products. Uh, how to ranchers um one in San Miguel and the other in Santa Tecla. Uh, which in the health headquarters. Mm -hmm. Okay, which are the headquarters in Santa Tecla. Okay, mm -hmm. good. Uh, who's next? Me, teacher. Yes, go ahead. Okay, um, my company is Universidad de Oriente. Uh, <clears throat> the company that I work for uh, mm -hmm. is known for teaching the future professionals. And our industry is the education industry. Our branches are in Anchico and Calepa, and our her, her headquarters is in San Miguel City. Excellent, good, perfect. Uh, who's missing, who's missing, who's missing, who's missing? Elena and Jessica. Okay, Um, the company is called Release Distribuidora. It is my classic classify in the different clothing products for men and women. And is industry is clothing store. Mm -hmm. 
has four branches across the country. Mm -hmm. Its headquarters are located in San Miguel. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, pronunciation, but we check later. Classify. Jessica? Okay, uh, my company is El Diario de Hoy and is dedicated to informing audience and the is the industry of entertainment news mm -hmm. and and report mm -hmm. about about i think is the same but news mm -hmm. and the location has uh, in san miguel mm -hmm. san salvador yes and santa ana in Santa Ana. <laughs> in Santa Ana, sorry. In. Okay, nice, good, perfect. So let's see, one, two, three, four questions are enough, people. Everybody spoke and I have enough information and material. All right, so whew, no nervous anymore. So whew, refresh. <laughs> yeah. But yes. I think, nice. I think, I think that we need to practice more pronunciation in class and more repetition, okay, about the grammar. The grammar will be okay. the order of the sentence. Yes, teacher. Although some of you seem like perfect, uh, like experts, okay? You speak very nice. You have practiced. Good. So we finish and we go to the main session. All right? You don't have free time as the other groups. You already had it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So right now, let's go to the main session and let's wrap up and let's go for 30 minutes of unit number three. Okay. Okay, the chat. Well, Thank you, the teacher. Room. Thank you, people. Okay, do you leave? Thank you. Excellent. Jessica was the first one. Okay, everybody, please join back to the class. All right, good, welcome back. Perfect, oh, not 29 people, we are complete, all right? Almost complete. Okay, people, nice to see you again. I hope you were uh, taking advantage of time. Hmm. Doing homework in the exam, probably. Oh, obviously. I hope. I hope. I hope. <laughs> okay. So, what? How, how do you think it was the experience? Because we almost took two classes for the oral exam. What do you think? Enough time or too much time, teacher? Not too much time. What do you think? I need opinions for the think about the other oral exam. Enough time for me is a perfect. Perfect because we practice a lot, right? Yeah, that's right. Yes. Okay. And I like that I was checking and you were practicing, okay? No more Spanish, but English. That was good. Thank you. Right? In the majority of the groups, because one group was like silent all the time. You, you, you're practicing individually, I think. Okay, but it's okay. So, in, my, in, my, in my case, I... Yeah, Luis? It's a good, a good oral exam. Ah, okay, nice. Yeah, and I was checking that probably we need more, more repetition, maybe more pronunciation practice or, or drilling of the grammar because I was checking some mistakes. But we're going to do it, don't worry. Okay? But a little mistakes. Uh -huh, a little mistakes, yes. I will check. <laughs> I will have the results on Monday, I hope. On. All right. So re remember, we are just missing two weeks. So take advantage, finish the activities. Now, remember, we are going to start unit number three. What was the, question? What was the question we were discussing? What was the question? Uh, I get, I, in English. Ah, but um, usually. Uh, <laughs> do you help your co-workers? Ah, okay, about. With, help. with the task, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. About helping co-workers, look. And we answered this one already, okay? Now, 
some of you help, obviously, your coworkers, but do you ask for help? Mm, is rarely? Rarely. Why rarely? Come? Rarely. Uh, because uh, it's in, in the specific case, I need a second opinion. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. It, it's it's, it's of depend of the, the case. It depends. Uh, yeah. Okay, someone else? Do you ask for help? Uh, Diana, do you ask for help to your coworkers? Help me, I cannot do my job. I can't, it's difficult for me, I don't know, something like that. Sometimes, teacher, when mm -hmm. I have to do some report that I have mm -hmm. never did, uh -huh. and uh, I ask for help, Mm -hmm. that I have never done okay you never never done. yeah that's part participle but that's another topic okay, okay. next uh where about Francisco okay got it mm -hmm. do you ask for help in your job no Francisco is not here still oh my goodness okay Eileen tell me Eileen <laughs> Uh, sometimes I do ask for help uh, with a report uh, because I am out of the company. <laughs> okay, okay, sometimes, good. Sometimes. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. Yeah, sometimes, I mean, we have many responsibilities and we need probably to ask. We need to ask for some help. Mainly if you are the boss. <laughs> <laughs> well, Carla, what do you say, Carla Antonieta? Do you ask your coworkers for help? Carla? No, maybe she has problems with the audio. I'm sorry, she told me she was having problems. Okay, Jessica? In my case, I... Sometimes I need to ask for mm -hmm. uh, for things, te technical things mm -hmm. for the camera or for the for the programs mm -hmm. we have. Excellent, that's right. Because uh -huh. uh, because we have a, a partners or coworkers has a, or have mm -hmm. have. Mm, more experience than me mm -hmm. because uh, I am John in my job. <laughs> uh, I'm new at my job. Okay. I'm new. I am I am new in a job. Uh huh. You are new in your job, probably. Okay. You have. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Good. So you give help and you ask for help both. All right. Let's change a little bit. Look. So tell me, what are some things you ask for at your job? Not only about work, it can be small things. What can you ask for help at your job? What is it, what is it, what is it, what is it? I lost it, I lost it. This one. Mm -hmm. When I need to know what is the correct extension or line. Ah, uh, okay. I need to transfer the call. Mm -hmm. To know the correct extension. Yeah. Ex Extension line, yeah, let's say extension line. All right, that's one. Another? How to use some functions of Excel. Okay, how to wow. use... Mm -hmm. How to use some Excel functions. All okay. right, okay. next. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, sure, uh, mm -hmm. in my case, uh, I ask for information about uh, about the building's project uh -huh. because it, it has soils and materials for construction. Information about the building's buildings projects, you said, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm, that's one. Okay, Jorge. Uh, when we don't know our work process, 
Ah, okay. To know some work processes. Mm -hmm. uh, something else? Uh -huh, we have, let's see. Okay, we have Cindy. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, in my job, I ask when I don't understand a law or a counting standard. Ah. Mm, I don't understand an account, sorry, standard, standard, mm -hmm, like that. All right, yeah, Eli? Uh, I ask my, my work for reports on how, how we are doing with the selling. Uh -huh. Sales reports, uh -huh. sales, sales uh -huh. reports. I'm uh, sorry, sorry though. Sales reports, okay, nice. Mm -hmm. Let's leave those. Maybe, okay, maybe with the practice, we understand exactly what kind of favors or things we ask in, in the job, okay? Why are we talking about these people? Because we are going to talk about the following. Look, like making, how do you say, request or asking for help or making requests. Look at the first one. Uh, Cindy, can you help me read? Look, could you? Could you print out the budget file? Uh, could you print out the budget file? How do you answer? Right away, Rita. Right away. So your answer is always yes. When people ask like this, is the answer is always yes. <laughs> Carlos, what about this question? Can you read it? Yeah. Uh, would you mind opening the window? Uh huh. Answer. Sure. No problem. Sure. No problem. Okay. The answer is always positive. All right. So we are going to use look these two grammar um words mean could and would you mind when we ask for polite requests polite it's like what? formal 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 requests ah, okay. polite requests or formal requests mm -hmm. oh. could and would you mind check the pronunciation could could, could Mm. Would, would, would you mind? Mm. Uh, not good because good is something mm. else. Would, would. would you mind? Mm -hmm. Would you mind? Would you mind? Yeah. So, and we are going to start, look, a request now. We are going to start with could. Yeah. It's easy. If you see the grammar, it will be really easy. Uh, Miguel, can you help me read the. the it's, Making a or formal request. Mm -hmm. Would you keep bringing my more coffee? Okay, this is when you are in a restaurant, right? Not in your job. But yeah. it says, could you please you bring... Please bring my more coffee? Uh -huh. Could you please bring me yes, more coffee? Yes, of course. No yes. problem. The answer is always <laughs> yes. Remember, the, the answer is always yes. Uh-huh. Okay. So check the brain and say, could, then the person. Would you please. Uh-huh. Bring, bring the me, verb. Bring me, bring me more coffee. And then the compliment. Excellent. Yeah. So here yeah. we have the parts. Look, here we have the parts. Uh, I need someone else to help me. <laughs> uh, Bel no, Belki is not there. I don't see her. All right. Ivan, can you help me with this again? Uh-huh. How to form the questions with this because they are questions. Start a request with could you follow it by the base form of many the verb, main the main verb plus mm -hmm. any complement first phrase. Okay, so look, phrase. it's it's very easy. You have Please. could you could the you, verb you. infinitive form, no modification of the verb. Yeah. The complement. The best form. The best form. Mm -hmm. The base form. You say the base form. Uh huh. 
Okay, Rolando, which are the parts of the requests with could? Uh -huh. Microphone, microphone. I am mm -hmm. in exam. Ah, ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. You can watch the class later. Thank okay. You. Ah, but, but okay, but the exam has no time limit. But don't worry. Mm -hmm. Carla Antonieta, which are the parts of the sentences when we make requests? Mm -hmm. Give me. Cold. Call you. Mm -hmm. Open. Not necessarily open because that is an example. Look. Ah. Close that. <laughs> uh huh. Oh. Give me. Could you beat me? Okay, so let's let's wait for someone else. Remember, try to take now so you don't forget. So Diana, teach us, please. <laughs> Which are the parts? of the requests with cool model verb the moral verb in this case cool it's a model verb okay what else yeah. do we need the verb in the base form and the complement a complement. A complement don't forget okay could you verb in base form and the complement okay so here we have could more you take my head, which? Yeah, say the example. <laughs> Could you teach the homework? Ah, can you show the homework or explain the homework? Okay, Boom. that's in class. Okay, that's about the class, excellent. We have more examples over here. Remember that we're talking about job. All right, Roxana, can you help me? Mm -hmm. Microphone, remember? The read teacher. Yeah, read the first one. Okay. Could you call me later? Mm -hmm. Sure. 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 Uh huh. Francisco? Okay. Could you make 10 copies of this paper? Right away. Right away. You see? Could you make copies of this paper? Okay. Miguel? Could you contact the tech support? No problem. No problem. All right. Could you? You're making Could a you? suggest, uh, no, you're making a request, asking for a favor, let's say. Uh-huh. Yeah. Good. So tell me some things that you ask for at your job. Tell me. Hmm. Something that you ask for at your job. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Tell me. Oh, could you send write report? Okay. Could you send the report? Don't forget to say please. Oh, sorry. Could Perfect. You... Could you send the report, please? Another one. Could you write right now? Could you? Could you write the writing that you were? Right. No, 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 no. Because you're talking no. about a person, about an activity that a person can do. Okay. You're asking the for a why, favor. Why? The the could you write the letter? Mm hmm. Teacher. Yes. Tell me. Um. What is the difference? Um. Could you and uh can and can. Okay, could is more formal than can. You can use can okay. with friends, okay, friends. Mm -hmm. But could is more like with your boss, with um, with someone else, but you use it more formal. Could is more formal, more polite. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Yeah, I don't remember how to say polite in Spanish. Politico? But Maybe political, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, but it's formal, formal, mm -hmm. more formal. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Who is more formal than can? Okay. That's the difference. But you can say, can you send a report, please? It's okay. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Number okay. three, give me another one. Could you give me a product list, please? Could you give me? The product list, please. The product list, all right. No, the, no. The, the product list. Ah, the product list, pronunciation. Yeah. Uh, so product products, products, the products product. list. Yes. Could you yes. program the online meeting? Okay, could you program yeah. the online meeting? Perfect. Uh huh. Could you turn off my computer, please? <laughs> okay, you're in a hurry. You want to go? Could At you? The end of the day. It's an example. <laughs> Can you turn off my computer, please? Excellent. You're asking for papers. Good. Then next, could could you make a copy for me? Mm -hmm. Make a copy for me. Don't, don't forget to say please, please, please and thank you. Please. Magic words, please and thank you. Okay, Jorge. Uh, could uh. you help me in this meeting, please? Ah, excellent. Ah, sorry. Could you help me in this meeting? Mm -hmm. Okay, you can please. copy them. You can copy them because sometimes you don't check the presentation later. Carla Antonieta says, could you turn on the computer, please? Could you give me the password? Okay, Jacqueline, good. Could you give me the password? Hmm, probably, we don't know. Um, <laughs> Jessica in Salvador. Could you please, no, could you remind me? Uh-huh. Uh, the date report, please. Okay, thank you for that. So that please can be over here. Could you please? Oh, okay, could you please? Okay, uh -huh. thank remind you. me. We have two options. Please at the end or please over here. Uh, yes. mm -hmm. Okay, we have two. Okay. We have two positions for for please. Uh, could you please do me a favor? <laughs> okay, that's nice, Kenya, the most common. Salvador, let's see if we have a space for your example. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. In my case for packaging, uh -huh. um, for example, could you send the packaging plan for the purchase okay. orders? What? Packaging plan for the purchase orders? I have to change the letter number. Okay. okay, there you are. Eh, you're missing something important. Mm -hmm, the magic word. Yes. Excellent. Gilberto, can you help us read? Number one to number five. Okay. Could you send the report, please? Mm -hmm. The second, uh, could you write the letter, please? Mm -hmm. Number three, could you give me the product, please? <laughs> Uh -huh. Number four, could you program the online meeting? Mm -hmm. Number five, could you turn off my computer, please? Thank you very much. Um, Jennifer, number six to number nine. Could you make a copy for me, please? Mm -hmm. Could you help me in this meet? Please. Meeting, 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 but. please. Cool. Uh huh. Go ahead. Could, could you please remind me, me remind, 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 remind me of the day report? Mm -hmm. okay, cool. Ah, yeah. Sorry. Uh, uh, we'll check this one. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Of the reports, date is the opposite people. Yeah. The reports. Date. It's like that. Mm -hmm. Sorry for that. I didn't check it before. Okay, Jennifer, finish with number nine. Could you send send the pa packaging packaging pa packaging plan for the purchase purchase orders orders please. Okay, pronunciation. We need to. Uh, Practice more, okay? Perfect, thank you. 
Okay, so these are your examples. Your examples. Teacher. Yes, tell me. Teacher, I have a, an idea. An idea. You know, mm -hmm. a, a, an idea. In the number number eight, mm -hmm. usually we use deadline. Ah, okay. Is mm -hmm. the the finish like yeah. the the top date you can the send top. it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. It's usually. Mm -hmm. That's better. It sounds better. Mm -hmm. If you mm -hmm. say date, it's okay. Maybe they are asking for another type of thing and not a due date. Uh, due date. Yeah. You say due date as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. But we have different synonyms. Thank you very much. Okay. Mm -hmm. That is could you remember? Could mm -hmm. you? Normal mm -hmm. verb. Infinitive form of the verb. Now, mm -hmm. let's move on to... I hope you copied some of them. Okay. Then we have, we, would you mind? It's like the same, but different grammar. Well, would you mind? The verb is a... Yeah, Miguel? Yeah. Nah, you can explain. <laughs> change, the, change the verb. G-A-N-F-A-G. I-N-G, I-N-G. I-N-G. Ah, so look at the difference. Miguel said it. In this case, you use I-N-G. Would you mind opening the window, please? Opening. Look. Yes, so we, we need. Modal verb. Modal verb? In, 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 uh, in complement. And complement. Okay. Sonia, which are the parts of the request grammar using would you mind? Hello. <laughs> Which are the parts of the sentence to create sentences for requests? Modal verb? Yeah, in this case, which is the modal verb or phrase? What you mean? Ma, mine, mine. My, what you mind? Excellent. Would you mind? What else do we need? Opening verb in ing. Mm -hmm. In the window, please complement. Okay, don't forget the magic word, please, 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 please. All right. So, would you mind opening the window, please? Please. And here we have some examples. Who's oh. going to help me? Uh huh. Elin, can you help me read num example number one, and then Carla Antonieta with number two? How? How you mind calling the plan manager? Mm hmm. Right. What? Yo era. Right away. Right away. Right away. Enseguida. Right away. Right away. Okay. So, would pronunciation. This one is kind of difficult because you have to do it very, very softly. Would you mind? Would you mind? Excellent. Would you mind calling the plan manager? The plan manager? Mm hmm. Uh huh. Right away, excellent. Practice, practice, practice. Okay, Alison, what about number two? Will you mind getting an appointment with the HR for me? The human resources, uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, human resources. Uh, in a minute. Minute, minute. Uh, sorry, minute. In a minute. minute. In a minute. Minimum, no, in a minute. <laughs> In a minute. <laughs> In a minute. All right. Remember, would you, Suavecito, would you mind? Getting. Okay. And the other one is for In Jessica. Now. Jessica. Read example Maybe. number three. Oh, yeah. Edge here. Uh, what is the uh -huh. edge here? Uh, HR is human resources department. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Jessica? If you can. Hello. Can you read this example? Yes, number three, right? Yes, yes, number three. Uh, okay. Could you mind sending this box for the cleaning department? Mm. No. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Okay. It's wood. Be careful. It's wood, not could. It's wood. Wood. Uh huh. It's would you mind sending? Mm. 
would you mind sending? Uh -huh. ING, we need ING people, mm -hmm. all right? So maybe the same examples, you can tell me the same examples from the last slide, but now this time using, okay. You, we can use the same examples over here, but now using would you mind? Mm -hmm. So we mm -hmm. use the ING this but time. Would you? So help me, what would be the first one? Would you mind? Uh -huh. Would you mind? Mind. Sending? Yeah. Uh -huh. Sending the report, please. Okay. <laughs> Would you Can't mind <laughs> sending the report? Uh -huh. Would you mind Would sending you mind the report? the exam. <laughs> uh -huh. Please. <laughs> okay, next. Teacher, would you mind take out the garbage, please? Uh huh. Would you mind hmm. take out the garbage, please? What do you say, people? Uh, taking out. Take. Taking. Uh, taking. 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 Uh huh. Remember, we would you mind? We need ing. Thank you. Taking. Another one. Um. Would you, would you mind? mind? Would you mind go? Going mm -hmm. mm, with me? Would you mind going with me? Okay, would you mind going with me? Magic or no magic word? In this case, because wood is like is still more polite, you can avoid the please. Mm -hmm. no, no, please. No. Because with the wood, yeah, you are saying wood, would you mind? <laughs> Asking <laughs> like that. Uh huh. So another one. Sure. Um, would you mind taking my case? Oh. Case, no sé cómo se dice. Case, like Please. portafolio, case. Uh, uh, llaves. Case. Case. My case. Ah, mi caso. Would you mind taking uh, uh, my case? case? No, no. Keys. Uh, keys. 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 Llaves. Keys. Ah, keys. my keys. Keys. My keys. keys. Please. Uh. Would you mind taking my keys, please? Okay, that can be. Teacher. Yes. Would, would, would you mind finish the report at 4 p.m., please? <laughs> that doesn't sound like a would request. Would. At 4 p.m. At 4 p.m., please. Finishing. And the answer is, I'm not a slave. I'm not a slave. <laughs> Okay. I'm not a robot. <laughs> I'm not a robot. But she is asking, or he is asking in a polite way. So it's okay or not? Check, check, check. Salvador. No, finishing. 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 Uh, don't forget finishing. ING, ING. Okay, ING. Cindy. Cindy and Rolando. Would you mind checking emails for me, please? Oh, would you mind checking oh. the emails for me? Remember, generally, when you ask with would you mind, the answer is always yes. Yeah. Okay, right away, in a minute. Sure, no problem. Right. Rolando and then Ivan. Uh, would you mind turning off your microphone? Oh, excellent. <laughs> For the class, turning off your microphone. Uh huh. Okay. Would you mind turning off your microphone? Next. Ah, sorry, Ivan. Uh, would you mind calling me when is the is in the house? Ah, when you get home. Get home. Uh huh. You're saying to your wife or your husband, right? Would you mind calling me when you get home? Okay. Okay. Nice. Would you mind? Taking the trash out of the office. Okay, Carla, that's nice. Only spelling mistakes. Uh, Jessica. Would you mind uh -huh. fixing? Fixing? Uh -huh. uh, the car tomorrow, please. Fixing. Ah, fixing. 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 Mm, my, my microphones don't work. My, my, my oh. earphones. <laughs> Would you mind fixing the car tomorrow? Good. Would you mind paying for the dinner? <laughs> okay. 
there we are. Another one, we have many people. Rolando, I don't know if you have set your example. What your mind? Checking. In the mic cooking for me, please. Mm -hmm. Okay, what? Would you mind? Would you mind cooking the lunch? Checking, checking, <laughs> checking my car. Oh, I would you mind car? checking my car? Okay, would you mind checking my car, please? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And the last one, because we don't have more space. Okay. Would you mind cooking the breakfast, please? Ah, would you, ah, you change it. Would you mind cooking breakfast, please? Mm -hmm. There we are. Okay, there we have many. And remember, they are in the presentation, so you can check. So, breakfast. My finger missed. I am known for my finger mistakes. For this. There you are. There you are. So, who's going to read it? Um, Belki, can you read number number one to number four, Belki? Okay. Would you mind sending the report, please? Mm -hmm. Would you mind taking out the garbage, please? Yes, number four, I think. Okay, no. okay. would you mind going with me, please? Uh -huh. Would you mind taking my keys, please? Excellent pronunciation, good pronunciation. Good, Luis, uh, can you help me read number five, six, and seven? Would you, like, would you mind finishing the report? At 4 p.m., please. Mm -hmm. Would you mind checking the email for me, please? Mm -hmm. Would you mind turning off the com my you com your microphone? microphone. Uh -huh. Turning off. Uh -huh. Turning, Turning off. off. Turning your off. Microphone. Off the microphone. Your microphone. All right. Thank you, Elena. The last one. Would you mind calling me when you get home? Would you mind fixing the car tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Would you mind checking my car? And would you mind cooking breakfast, please? Would you mind? Mind. Mm -hmm. Would you mind? Would you mind cooking? Uh huh. Good mind. Because when I'm in the main mind. Okay. So let's see. Yeah, let's do some of them because of the breakup rooms. We need to finish a little bit five minutes later at least. Okay. So look at this situation and you're going to tell me the correct request using could and using would you mind. How would you say it? Raise your hand. Francisco was the first one. Mm -hmm. I have to use could or would. The two. The two. Could you open the window, please? Uh huh. Yes. And would you mind opening the window, please? Perfect. Bye, people. That's the way. Okay. So we see the difference between using could and would. All right. Perfect. Thank you. Next person, look at this one. Raise your hand. No Francisco this time until next time. Jessica, yes. The first uh, question is, could you please make a cup of tea? Okay. okay. And y la otra es, could and you mind? Uh, yeah, I understand. Uh, could you mind making a cup of tea, please? Excellent. There you yeah. are. Look. Jackai, Jackai, pardon. Uh, don't worry. Thank you. I, sometimes we do a sponge. Ah, now you understand. Excellent, Jessica. Okay, next. Raise your hand, people. Raise your hand. Hmm, this is kind of complicated. Salvador? Sorry, my microphone. Uh -huh. Could you speak? No, no, no. 
No. Oh, but, sorry. Could you Bernie. give? Could you give your? Mm -mm. No. Could G you give, give? Give me. Uh huh. A newspaper, please. Mm -hmm. Okay. Could you give me a or the? Mm -hmm. Depends. Could mm -hmm. you give me? Uh huh. And would you mind? Would you giving me the uh -huh. newspaper? Would you mind? giving me the newspaper please there you are yes would you mind giving me the newspaper okay miguel okay who you mind uh -huh. remind me <laughs> the, uh, the last homework please mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can we paraphrase that? Remember, use could. Could, could. you? Uh -huh. could, could you? you could you? Could you mind? Could you in the verb? Check. Check uh -huh. your homework, please. Okay. Teacher, could you check my homework, check please? Check my homework, please. Now, and the other is... Uh, your. Who, ah, the other one. Yes. Who, 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 would. Would you mind checking my homework, please? There you are. Teacher, would you mind checking my homework, please? Before I put it yeah. in the school, <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Gilberto. Um, <clears throat> could you count the new products, please? Mm -hmm. In the second example, would you mind counting the new product, please? Uh -huh. Counting. Counting, new product. yeah. Counting. counting. Yeah. Counting. Excellent. This one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what about that one? I won't say names. <laughs> okay, raise your hand. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to participate, okay? Francisco and Gilberto. Okay, Francisco. Okay, uh, to the student. Uh, could you turn, turn on the camera, please? Yes. Okay, and could you mind turning on your camera, please? Excellent, okay. Remember with the verb turn, with the phrase turn on, we can divide it. We can say turn on your camera or turn your camera on. Separate. Two options with that phrase, turn on. All right, thank you. I think I'm missing only one. I'm giving you the answer. Yes, I'm missing only one. So who gives me this? And we continue Monday. If you don't say it, we don't go. <laughs> Yeah. No, Belki. 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 Yeah. Ah, Belki. Ah, be, uh, yeah. Ivan, 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 Ivan was first, I think. Hey, hey no? could you... For a bicycle. Mm -hmm. Could you call uh -huh. the supervisor, please? Uh-huh. They don't say uh, please. They don't say please, but okay. <laughs> Go okay. ahead. Would you mind call, calling... Your supervisor, please. Excellent. There you are. Okay. Would you mind calling your supervisor, please? Uh, no, I don't. I won't. Okay. <laughs> Remember, uh, according to what we are studying, the answers are always uh, what? Positive, right? The answer is always positive. Okay. Uh, Any? Is, yes. Questions, please. At the same cool. Or uh, would you mind? In this case, yes. Ooh. But remember that would you mind is more polite. Yes. We have can, no, sorry. We have can, could, and would you mind, like this. Can, could, and would you mind, like a, it, it is know, saying, mistake. would you like? Uh, would you like is different. No, te gustaría, no, would you like. This one is okay. te importaría, okay? No. It's different. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any other question? No question, teacher. <laughs> no, no question. Teacher. So we continue a little bit with this on Monday. 
before we start with the next. Okay, I think that is book out okay. there. All right. Happy weekend. Have a nice weekend. Okay, complete I the activities. Have a, I have a question. Yes. And the teacher will give you the results. If not, not. Okay, okay. question. Tell me a question. Uh, how can I see the the result of the exam for the first uh, oral? Up, uh, no, the, the writing. The written. Okay, when you close the exam, you open the exam again and you have a result. You see a result over there. I, okay. I think I think you have to close sure. it. Tienen que cerrarlo y volverlo a abrir para que le salga. Or maybe just updated the, ah, the page. Refresh, refresh. Uh -huh. Refresh. Ah, just refresh. refresh. Refresh the page also. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. If not, send me a message and I will tell you how much you have. Okay, so see you on Monday. You. Please, everybody, join. We are missing two weeks. Yes? Good. Okay. Have a nice weekend. Bye. Have a nice Bye. weekend. Bye. 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 Bye.